about one angle being 45 the best part is the other angle the other acute angle will also be 45 provided the triangle is a right triangle and now what happens is they're asking for cos or sine 45 let's say sine you know that when angles are 45 degrees each then the sides will be equal so I'm saying the equal side is one unit one unit I also said that this when two sides when two legs are one unit each then the hypotenuse will always be root 2 times the length or it will always be square root 2 times whatever the length we have for the legs so if it is 1 then it will be just root 2 times 1 root 2 now it's very easy to remember that no matter you're finding the sine value or the cos value you are actually doing the same thing what you're doing is for sine 45 it's opposite perpendicular upon hypotenuse or opposite upon hypotenuse which is 1 upon root 2 so we get the answer 1 upon root 2 for sine similarly for cos you can do the same thing because both the base and the opposite have the same value here we'll still get the same answer as for sine which is 1 upon root 2 and hence you can remember that sine 45 cos 45 do have the same value eventually giving you the tan 45 value as tan being the ratio of sine to cos because the values are equal tan 45 is 1 and when you know these values you can always find the other three trigonometric ratios without having to worry about it